on Fairview in Glen Ellen. I'm about to make a phone call. I'm gonna turn off my cellular data on this AT&T mobile phone. And I'm going to make a phone call. Hi there, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Thanks, bye. Bye. This proves there's no significant gap of coverage at Fairview and Park Boulevard in Glen Ellen on an at and I am standing here at Park and Fairview and I have a, a Sprint phone and I'm gonna turn off the cellular data on this. This is the cellular data, I'm turning it off, and I'm gonna make a phone call. Hello? Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Great, thank you, bye. bye. This proves that there is no significant gap of coverage at Fairview and Park Boulevard on a Sprint cell phone. I am standing here at Fairview and Park Boulevard and I'm about to make a phone call with a T-Mobile phone. I am turning off my data, my cellular data. Turn off and I'm gonna make a phone call. Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Thank you, bye. This proves there is no significant gap in coverage at Park and Fairview on a T-Mobile phone. I am standing here at Fairview and Park Boulevard and I'm about to make a phone call with a Verizon phone. And I will show you that the data, mobile data is off and I will make a phone call. Hold on. Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Great, thank you. This proves there is no significant gap in coverage at Park and Fairview for a Verizon phone. Okay, I'm standing here in front of Lombard West. I'm about to make a phone call with an AT&T phone. I'm going to turn off the cellular data and I'm going to make a phone call. Hello? Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Thank you, honey. Bye. Bye. That proves there is no significant gap in coverage for an AT&T cell phone at Glumbar West. West, and I'm about to make a phone call with a Sprint cell phone. I'm going to turn off the cellular data and I'm going to make a phone call. Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Great, thank you, bye. So that proves that there is no significant gap in coverage for a Sprint cell phone at Glenbard West. I am standing West. in front of Glenbard West and I have a T-Mobile phone in my hand. I'm gonna make a phone call with this T-Mobile cell phone. I'm gonna turn off the cell data, cellular data, turn off.
I'm gonna make a call. Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Thank you, bye. Bye. That proves that there is no significant gap in coverage for a T-Mobile phone at Glenbard West. I'm standing West. in front of Glenbard West and I have a Verizon phone in my hands. I'm gonna make a phone call with a Verizon phone and I'm gonna turn off the cellular data. Mobile data, turn it off. And I'm gonna make a phone call. Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Great, thanks. Bye, honey. Bye. That proves that there is no significant gap in coverage for a Verizon cell phone at Lombard West. I'm standing here at Bryant and Hill at one of the sites of the applications that's currently in right now. And I have a, an AT&T cell phone in my hands. I'm gonna turn off the cellular data and I'm gonna make a phone call. Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Okay, thanks. Bye. Bye. So this proves there is no significant gap in coverage at Bryant and Hill for AT&T phones. I'm standing here at Bryant and Hill, and I have a Sprint cell phone in my hands. This is one of the application sites, um, and I am going to turn off the cellular data on this phone. It is now off and I'm going to make a phone call. Oh? Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Thank you, bye. So this proves there is no significant gap in coverage at Bryant and Hill on a Sprint cell phone. Hi, I'm standing here at Bryanson Hill and I have a T-Mobile cell phone in my hands. This is the site of an application that's come in from Verizon. I am going to make a phone call from this T-Mobile phone. I'm gonna turn off the mobile data, turn off, and I'm gonna make a phone call. Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Great, thank you, bye. This proves there is no significant gap in coverage at Bryant and Hill on a T-Mobile device. I am standing here at Bryant and Hill. This is one of the sites for the applications coming in from Verizon. I have a, a Verizon phone in my hands. I'm gonna turn off the mobile data and I'm gonna make a phone call. Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Great, thank you. Bye. This proves there is no significant gap in coverage at Hill and Bryant for a Verizon cell phone. I'm standing here at Oak and Lennox and I'm about to make a phone call with an AT&T cell phone. I'm going to turn off the cellular data on it. And I'm going to make a phone call. Hello? Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can. How, how well can you hear me? I can hear you loud and clear. Great, thanks, bye.
That proves that there is no significant gap in coverage for an AT&T phone at Lennox and Oak. I'm standing here at Lennox and Oak and I have a uh, Sprint phone in my hands. I'm going to make a phone call. I'm going to turn off the cellular data. Hello? Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Thank you, bye. That proves that at Lennox and Oak, there is no significant gap in coverage for a Sprint cell phone. I'm standing here at Lennox and Oak, and I have a T-Mobile phone in my hands. I'm gonna make a phone call. I'm gonna turn off the cellular data on this phone. I'm gonna make a phone call. Hello? Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Thanks, bye. This proves that at Lennox and Oak, there is no significant gap in coverage for a T-Mobile phone. standing here at Lennox and Oak, and I have a Verizon phone in my hands. I'm going to make a phone call. I'm going to turn off the cellular data on this phone. And I'm going to call. Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Great, thanks, bye. That proves that there is no significant gap in coverage for a Verizon phone at Lennox and Oak. Okay, I'm at Park and Hill, another location for an application site. And I'm gonna make a phone call with an AT&T phone. I'm gonna turn off the mobile data on this phone. And I'm gonna make a phone call. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Thank you. Bye. Bye. So this proves there is no significant gap in coverage at Park and Hill for an AT&T I am making a device. phone call with a Sprint device at Park and Hill, where this is this is another site for an application here in Glen Ellen. And I'm going to make a phone call. I'm going to turn off the cellular data first. Data is off. And then I'm going to call. Hello? Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Great, thank you, bye. Bye. So this proves there is no significant gap in coverage for a Sprint phone at Park and Hill. I am about to make a phone call on a T-Mobile phone at Park and Hill, another location for an application here in Glen Ellen. I'm going to turn off my cellular data. Turn off. And I'm gonna make a phone call. Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Great, thank you, bye. Yeah. This proves there is no significant gap in coverage at Park and Hill with a T-Mobile phone. I am standing here at Park and Hill and I have a Verizon phone in my hand. This is another site. This is another site for an application here in Glen Ellen for 5G. And I'm gonna make a phone call. I'm gonna turn off the cellular data first. This is the mobile data button. I'm turning it off. Turn off. And I'm going to make a phone call. Hello? 
Hi, can you hear me? Yes, can I? I can hear you loud and clear. Great, thanks, bye. Bye. This proves there is no significant gap in coverage for a Verizon phone at Park and Hill. I'm at Spring and Roslyn, and I have an AT&T phone in my hand. I'm standing in front of the another application that's going on that pole right there. I will take this AT&T phone, I will turn off the data on this, and then I will call. Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Thank you, bye. So this proves that at Spring and Rosslyn, there is no significant gap in coverage for an AT&T phone. Hey, I'm at Rosslyn and Spring. This is an, another site for an application here in Glen Ellen. I have a um, Sprint phone in my hands and I'm gonna make a phone call. So I have to turn off the cellular data and I will make a phone call. Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Thank you, bye. Bye. So, as you can see, this proves that at this location, there is no significant gap in coverage for a Sprint cell phone. Okay, I'm standing here at Rosslyn and Spring Avenue. This is a an application site um, in Glen Ellen, and I have a uh, T-Mobile phone in my hands. I'm gonna turn off the cellular data And I'm going to make a phone call. Hello? Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Great, thank you. Bye. This proves that at this location, there is no significant gap in coverage for a T-Mobile phone. I'm standing here at Spring and Rosslyn. This is another location site for an application. I have a Verizon phone in my hands. I'm gonna turn off the cellular data. I'm gonna make a phone call. Hello? Hi, can you hear me, love? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Thank you, bye. So this proves there is no significant gap in coverage for a Verizon cell phone at this location.